इश्क लेता है On Bierlor led the hell. Hello, Tierut Agus Slan. Led the hell. The menu on Bierlor led the hell. Tierweave. Hello. Tirut Agaslan. Tirut. Hello to you. Glad to be with you. Tirut Agaslan. Yes, looks like. Tirut. Tia is Murut. Hello. Hello to you. God and Mary with you. Dear Reeb, August Sloan. Yeah. I think it's D A O I B H. To you, plural. August Sloan. And goodbye. August Sloan. Hello. Dear Ruth. Dear is Murigut. Dear is. Dear-Ruiv. Hello. Dear is Mujer. Good. Welcome back to Language Institute. I'm your verb ally. Starting with a bit of Irish this evening. Let me draw your attention to our homepage here. We've got our recently published books. These are from last year, these pun books. And here is what our Korean learner's notebook looks like. Got some nice paper with grids for writing practice and helpful reference info at the front. Useful charts and such. You can get those on our website. And let me tell you about us. If you're new here, we are a language school in Dallas and we teach English, Korean, Spanish, Chinese, French, German, Japanese, Portuguese, Italian. So I'm going to be doing a bit of Irish tonight and some Norwegian and whatever else anyone suggests. Whatever we feel like on this stream, on this channel, what I'm doing is learning everything that Duolingo teaches. Before you. You're welcome. How am I? Hello. Atami. Connus Atami. Connus Atami. How am I? What an odd question. Ta fault root. You're welcome. Ta long. Falche also long. Ro what? Root. Ni ban me. Ni ban me. I'm not a woman. Ni far me. A man. Ni, I am negative. But be fair man. Me with a long vowel. Ni fair me. Martin Wa. Martin Wa. Good morning. Come to Tommy. A ta question form of B. How am I? Gurumahagut. Gurumahagut. 
So something like good to you. Thank you. Martin wa. Martin and then the H there with M softens it to a W. Wa. TH sounds like H. I am not a man. Not be is me. We have the word for man, fair. And the word I, me. Konus atashi? How is he? Konus atashi. Thank you. Gorov ma hagat. Gorov ma hagat. Gorov ma hagat. Plural addressy. Tom goma goramagat. Time, I am. Goma, I'm very well. Go, rough, ma, agat. I'm very well, thanks. Tom, goma, gorov, ma, gorov, ma, agat. Tom, goma, gorom, agat. So, go is repeated, ma is repeated. Good morning, Ma Chinwa. In this combination, the M of the second word mutates. That kind of mutation, of which there's a lot in Irish, tends to happen within a phrase. Occasionally see it at the beginning, but that's more rare so far. I'm going to finish this little cycle. Berla. Berla means English. May have a long A there. Dear it. Cohortis. Hello, congratulations. Cohortis. So the H basically shows the softening of a consonant. MH for a V, GH for a V. Cohortis. Loud and she. Loud and she. He speaks. We speaks. Loud image. La fra imid. Re image. Loud image. Loud and she. Goilge. He speaks Irish. Loud and she. Goilge. Loudy mit. We speak. Laura. E is long. Mitch. Top row norum slon. Sorry, bye. Top row norum. There is sorrow upon me. Please was what? Let ahead. Top row norum. Two complete sentences. Well, let ahead is not a sentence. The top row arm has a subject and a preposition. Loud in Berla. I speak English. Loud in Berla. Brown. Brown. Sorrow. Sadness. Loud in Goilge. Loud in Goilge. I speak Irish. We speak English. Loud. Image. Berla. I speak English. Laurim. Laurim. Berla. Hello. Tiot. Cohorges. Co. R. I. R. D. E. A. S. Alright, let's go to number two for today. Norwegian. Much more closely related to English. Irish is two, the distant relative. Okay, pretty happy with our progress here. About a quarter of the course or so we've seen. 
Reiner. 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 The G sounds like an eng here. En TV. TV. En. En. When it means one, we have an accent as an indefinite, unaccented. Musik. Musik, or slash S. En. Reiner. Reiner, or is it a Y sound? Det reiner ikke. Ikke means not. It rains not. Beklager. Beklager. Sounds like complain. Beklager. Sorry. Beklager is an inflective verb form. Apparently. Could be a plural. Mannen dør hjemme. Dør hjemme. Mannen dør hjemme. Dør. The man something home. Dør. Oh, at home. Is dying, dies. Okay, död, the participle meaning dead, from dauðas. Jag tror jag dör. Jag. Jag. Tror. Jag. Dör. I think it's I trust I'm dying. I think I am. Tror. Okay, a nice thing about this structure is we have a sentence within a sentence, the famous property of recursion in language. Structure of one type within a larger structure of the same type. Jeg tror, that's the stem, tro, R in ending. And then I'm going to mark a complete sentence with this double pipe. Jeg dør. And for the U, a good resource is Lexilogos. Tell it what language you want. And generally, yeah, type it equals after a letter to get a modified character. Dur, oops, not there. Yeah, I dur, not there either. So I think I'm dying. I think is not a complete sentence, really. Probably not in either language. But the inner one, I'm dying, is a complete one. And then that whole thing together, I think I'm dying, of course, is also a complete sentence. Jeg spiser mye fisk og lite kjøtt. Mye fisk og lite kjøtt. Mye. Mye. Okay, like mykke. And little. I have a lot of fish and little meat. Lite kjøtt. Jeg spiser mye fisk og lite kjøtt. Jeg spiser mye fisk og lite kjøtt. Mye fisk og lite kjøtt. Gode bøker er alltid for korte. Korte. Gode bøker er alltid for korte. 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 Good books are always for short. For. Too short. Interesting. Nice. Good books are always, altid, means all time. Too short. Foreshortened. Hun beklager. She complains. Sounds like me, thinking from German. Hun beklager. She is sorry. Han beklager. He is sorry. Han beklager. Alle dør. Everyone dies. Alle dør. Summation of Hamlet. Det regner ikke her. It's... Not right here. Okay, in both languages, we have dummy subjects. D means that, I think. That rains not here, word for word. Hun spiser et lite jordbær. It's the small strawberry. Hun spiser et lite jordbær. It. I guess it would be E. Hun spiser et lite jordbær. Okay, the T is sounded. Et lite jordbær. En jente spiser. En jente. Is that a girl? En jente. Girl eats. One girl eats. Accented for the new one. Jeg er et lite barn. I am the small child. Jeg er et lite barn. A. The would be shown with a suffix. Looks like definite, but it's indefinite. Barn, even though it refers to humans, is a neuter noun. Regner det der? Is it raining there? 
Regner de det er. Here the final T is not heard. En forelder spiser pasta. A parent eats pasta. En forelder spiser pasta. One parent. Skjeen min er for stor. It's too big. My ski is too big. Skjeen min er for stor. Er my spoon. Okay, sked in Swedish. Is it just S-K-J-E? Dictionary will know. I think the E-N at the end would be the definite article. I'm doing book mål, so let's look there. Scathe. Worship. <laughs> That's quite a development. Sheath, read. I don't know what a sleigh is. This one, S-K-E-D in Swedish, unexpectedly is pronounced weird. Here, what's the she? She. Ship or warship. Spoon. Feminine or masculine. How cool. My spoon is too big. Sorry. Beklager. I have eight kroner. Too little. Jeg har... Ott, åtte. Beklager. Jeg har åtte kroner. For lite. Try this word order. Two kroner, too few, too little. They have only one child. It's going to be, de har bare et barn. De har. De har bare. Their only. Et, et barn. barn. Bare et barn. Jeg takker deg. Okay, thank you. I, word for word, I. And these are all related forms. Takker comes from thankar. Closer to thank. Thank you. Well, you is not the V. I think V would be closer. Jeg husker ham. Husker, I like him. Is that what it is? Husker. I remember, I remember him. Our word remember, ultimately from Latin. Husker du? Do you remember? Husker du? Name of a band from the 70s, I think. 70s or 80s. Jeg snakker norsk også. So, jeg snakker norsk også. I speak Norwegian too. Hun lukter en elg. Lukter, det ser han av. The dog something. Lukter. Smells, wow. Dog with the definite marking suffix here. Smells, scents, a moose. Har du også hund? Har du også hund? Hund. Har? Du også hun. I think it's going to be hunden, the dog. Hun, a dog, just no article. Okay, hunden. Foreldrene mine er amerikanere, men jeg er norsk. <laughs> Foreldrene mine er amerikanere, men jeg er norsk. My parents are American. Plural definite noun here, but I'm going to use the adjective. Men, but. Jeg er norsk. I am Norwegian. Du lukter. You smell. Du lukter. Han er også amerikaner. He is also American. Det lukter. It smells. Det lukter. Er han der også? Is he there too? Er han der også? Også. Vi har salt, men ikke pepper. We have salt, but not pepper. Vi har salt, men ikke pepper. Han takker læreren for bøkene. Takker. He thanks the teacher for the books. Lærerin. I think this one's singular. Lærer is the stem. Lera. He. But then the bøkene is plural definite. He thanks the teacher. For, just like ours. 
Hun takker kokken for maten. He thanks the cook for the food. Hun, she, hun takker kokken for maten. She thanks the cook. Han er ikke rik, men han er kjekk. Kjekk. So, I know the first part, he's not rich, but he is stylish. Kjekk. Kjekk. So, a J, a jad sound, ja, will soften a K to a Sj. Hun takker han for brevet. Similar to the Irish uh, mutation, but different motivation. Hun takker han for brevet. She thanks him for the letter. Hun takker ham for brevet. Dyret lukter ikke. It doesn't smell. Dyret lukter ikke. Husker hun meg? Does she remember me? Husker hun meg? Hun. Husker du når den åpner? Åpner. So do you remember? Husker når? When? Åpner. When it opens. Husker du når den åpner? Remember when it opens. Okay. Pappas kaffekopp er ikke rød, men oransje. Oransje. Father's coffee cup is not red, but orange. Pappas kaffekopp er ikke rød, men oransje. Rød. Pappas kaffekopp er ikke rød, men oransje. Men oransje. Written N here in the column. Orange. But probably an imitation of the French. Back to an N. Orange. Har du også hun? Do you also have a dog? Har du also, also. And then just a plain, the bare noun. Hun. Do you also have dog? Okay, let's do a bit of Korean. Jump to the other side of the globe for a moment. Then go back to Northern Europe. Omoni. Omoni is mom. Omaga chago isso. Omaga chago isso. Mom is sleeping. Omaga go apa. 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 Abba? Oh, a person. I thought it was a verb. Mom and Dad. 어머니 그리고 아들. 그리고 아들. My mother and son. 어머니 그리고 아들. 아니, 내가 너의 아버지다. 내가 너의 아버지다. 아니, no. 내가. No, you are. Nega. No, I am your dad. Nega is a fusion, yeah. I am. Noi, your father. We can say that. Aboji kurigo tal. Tal. Aboji kurigo tal. Father and daughter. Aboji ga tarago nureago isoyo. Aboji ga tarago. Nule ha ko. Isayo. Okay, father with daughter is doing songs, is singing. Aboji ga tarago nule ha ko isayo. Or we could say, oh, look at the two different functions of ha ko. Participial, or yeah, progressive tense mark, progressive aspect. Nule ha ko, doing, singing. And 딸하고 with daughter. 딸과 아들은 자식입니다. 딸과 아들은 daughter and son. Uh, yeah, daughter and son. 자식입니다. 자식. 자식입니다. Mm -hmm. Our children. Let's make them plural. Daughters and sons are children. Chashik, I'm going to make a note for myself. Chashik, child. Sushi, I think the kanji are going to be the hanja. Hanja. 
a child. And then it's the one that means breath, I think, on its own. So H U P. I think it's this one. Oh, a question mark. Well, let's look it up real quick. It's a great online dictionary that is free called Neighbor. Child Children's Offspring. Children Offspring. There it is. I don't think this compound is used in modern Chinese, but I think it is in Japanese. 부모들과 자식들. 부모들과 자식들. Parents and children. Children. 우리 어머니는 예쁘세요. 예쁘세요. Our mother is pretty. 엄마, 배고파. 엄마, 배고파. I'm hungry. Belly is empty. 사랑해요, 엄마. 사랑해요, 엄마. I love you, mom. 아빠, 어디야? 어디야? Dad, where are you? 아버지와 어머니는 부모입니다. 부모입니다. Dad and 아버지. Yeah, dad and mom are parents. Fathers and mothers, we could say. 그 여자는 아들 다섯 명이 있어요. 그 여자는 아들 다섯 명이 있어요. That woman. We will use a transitive verb has. 아들 다섯 명. Ten, five sons, not ten. Has five sons. But more closely to the Korean sentence structure would be as for that woman. Sons, five of them exist. 부모는 자식이 있어요. 자식이 있어요. As for parents, children exist. The parents have children. A nice redundant. 엄마는 늑대가 좋아. 엄마는 늑대가 좋아. So mom likes 늑대, which I don't recall. 늑대가. Wolves. Okay, let me get a Korean keyboard. Password. Look is a nice rotatable, 180 degree symmetrical syllable. Syllable block. Syllable blockhead. 동생. Actually, I don't want to continue with this right now. We'll come back to it later. Do we have one for greetings and phrases? Questions. Hmm. Dates, time, family. Let's do places. Chambre looks like French chambre. It doesn't look much like it, but I think it comes from that. Chishjin. Chambre folka. Folka. Nice to hear these. Looks like we've, we've got metathesis. I suspect there was an older kitchen, but the ST is more frequent, and so that went out. Chambre. Call with the kitchen. Where is your kitchen? See mutation. Do with the possessive word for it. Thy kitchen. Soften a k to a ch. Fricative. Where is your kitchen? And that would be in the same phrase for this time. Will is also lenited, mutated. It's in the phrase with ka, more or less. Yeah, to beware. Where be? Bathroom. Shomrafol ka. Uh, we see the typical Celtic compound order, the head first, room of bath or whatever. On Tachmor, my house, the big house. And this Tach is related to our thatch, I believe. Cover, covering. Call him Imushomra. Imushomra, mutation of Shomra. Call him is I sleep. 
we get this nice prepositional phrase in my room. Call with the trona. What's that? The meaning is where are the trona beaches? Call with dostan. Dostan. Call with dostan. Where is thy hotel? Okay, hosts, I think it's going to be related to host and that family of words. Where is your hotel? Is Kishin Kishin Halach Kishin Halach E. She is a dirty kitchen. It is a dirty kitchen. Tain Shakati and Shumra Folka. Tain Shakati and Shumra Folka. There we have it. Tain Shakati and Shumra Folka. Folka. TH gives a huh sound. Folka. It's hard to really perceive it there. Goes he toward the bathroom. Tain Shakati and Shumra Folka. Colum san ostan, ach ichim sa vialan. Vialan. I sleep. This is in the, I think. I sleep. It's a fusion word, sun. In the hotel. Ach is but. I eat in the restaurant. Sa vialan. In a. In the. I think it's whether there's a vowel following. Whether you get this N or not. Yay. So be along. Time it jach a nid. Time it jach a nid. Jach. In the house of the man. I am in the man's house. Mobilan, no abilan. Oh, I love this position. Okay. It's the same noun in both cases. My restaurant, but with different possessors. My restaurant, no or. A bialan, I think it's going to be his restaurant. It could be his or her. It's just in mutation that you have the gender difference marked. Let's try his. Yeah, her. Okay, yeah, got to remember that Indo European uh, pronoun inflection. The difference is that the ancestor of the word for his ended in a vowel, and so you get a v in a case like this. And the ancestor meaning her ended in an s, so a consonant, so you don't get that change. Snovenshed egentra. For this, it's good to know some Sanskrit. Snovenshed egentra. Egentra. Snovenshed. They swim at the beach. Egentra. Snobin gets a long mark. Okay, she had Agatra. Agatra. Snobin she had Agatra. Agatra. Unshumra Folka. The bathroom. And the English compound bathroom, the head of it, it's a kind of room, not a kind of bath. Head comes last, in Celtic it comes first. Irene Meliantor Sachach. This is my. Artist, yes. My artist works in the house. I bring million tour such a ta and van egg shoe could you and kosher. The kosher kosher is party. Is the woman at walking to the party. It's not a question. The verb just comes first in a declarative sentence. The woman is at the walking. She, she is currently walking to the party, definite. I will to able to do good in Hoshir. Do good in Hoshir. Able to do. To go to. Do good. Looks nothing like the other forms of go. Are you able to? Maps nicely, sound for sound to. Able to. Are you able to go? Can you go to the party? 
Movilan no Abilan. My restaurant or her restaurant. This one of nine. Ooh. That's going to take a while to do. Family five. An uncle. En tante. Tante. Beste foreldre. Beste foreldre. Yes, grandparents. En onkel. Onkel. Onkel tante are from Latin, ultimately. Kind of unfair. Slektninger. Siblings. Okay, like geslecht, meaning like race or tribe in German. I think that's cognate. Beste foreldre. Beste foreldre. En tante. En tante. Søsteren til en mor er en tante. Til en mor. Oh, the, sis the sisters to a mother. Interesting. Oh, søsteren. It's not plural marked there. It's just definite. The sister to a mother is an aunt. Word for word. A mother, sister, and aunt. Sister of a mother. Beste foreldre. Beste foreldre. Ok, slektninger is relatives, not siblings. Slektninger. Slektninger. It's a nice tonal pattern to it. Hva heter onkelen din? <laughs> Singular definite. The uncle of thine. What's your uncle's name? We have a verb heter to be called. Heisen. Hvor er bestefars sko? Bestefars. Possessive form, grandfather's shoe. Where is grandpa's shoe? Tanten min har hun. Or, Tanten min har hun. Has dog. My aunt has a dog. Jeg har slektninger i Norge. There'd be a fun one in, in Korean, because dog and aunt are now near sound alike. Or is it K-me? Yeah. Jeg har slektninger i Norge. Relatives in Norway. Jeg har slektninger i Norge. Barnebarna skriver brev. Grand, the grandchildren. Child to child. Children of children. I lost a window. Okay, now there it is. Grandchildren, write a letter. Vi har fem barnebarn, tre jenter og to gutter. Fem. We have five grandchildren. Three girls and two boys. Bestemor har bilder av alle barnebarna sine på veggen. Beste mor har bilder av alle barnebarna sine på veggen. Upon the way, I don't know that last phrase, the grandmother has pictures of all her grandchildren upon the, oh, this could be window, on the wall. Or vacant. See now the possessive coming after the noun. We've got two ways to place it in. Oops. Brother mine, grandchildren thine. Skriver du brev til slektningene dine? Skriver du brev til slektningene dine? Do you write letters? I think it's plural. Til meaning to. Relatives thine. Your Tack för böckerna, bästa far. Tack för böckerna, bästa far. Unkarna mina är björner. My uncles 
The uncles of mine are bears. Onklene mine er bjørner. Har du slektninger der? Do you have relatives there? Har du slektninger der? Broren til en far er en onkel. The brother to a father is an uncle. Broren til en far er en onkel. Er en. 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 Barnebarna er på besøk. På besøk. The grandchildren are visiting. Barnebarna er på besøk. Til besøk. You are my grandchild. Du er barnebarn min. Er, du er, du er. Barna. What's it going to be? It's going to be definite singular. So, barna barne. Yeah, barne barnet. Spelling, barne barne. That's for agree. No, that's for gender marking. Definite. Meet from meet. You are my child of child. Du er du er mitt barn i barn. The other word order and no definite suffix on the noun. Love that. My aunt has a dog. Tanten min har hun has dog. Beautiful. Maybe I'll save the Irish until Levi can join us again. I know he enjoys, I think he enjoys that one particularly. Let's do a bit more Czech continuing from yesterday. Why not? Ona so dlouha. Dlouha. They. She. No, it's they. So the verb tells me that they are long. Jsou to velká zvířata. Zvířata. Velká. Big. They are the big animals. Zvířata. Okay. They are. Okay. To the subject. It looks like it's part of the following phrase, but I think it's not. And we just have some stylistic word ordering of the verb first. To so velka slova. Here it's more common subject verb and the rest. They are velka slova. Big words. Slova. Mm -hmm. Ta slova sou krátka. Krátka. This is short. Krátka. Krátka. Those words are short. Ta náměstí jsou velká. Ta náměstí jsou velká. Náměstí, don't recall. Squares. Jsou oh. velká. Let's look that one up. Check word for square. Singular for the dictionary. Nam yes D looks looks the same. Na miesto. City. And na means not the Icelandic one. Okay, wrong entry. Something to do with city. <laughs> so belga. Da gefchata so heska. Jevčata, so hezka. Those jevčata girls are pretty. Ta jevčata so hezka. Krátka slova so dobra. Krátka slova so dobra. Short words are good. 
Ta děvčata jsou mladá. Ta děvčata jsou mladá. Ta děvčata, those girls, are mladá. Young, right? Ta slova nejsou dobrá. Ta slova, those words, nejsou dobrá. Aren't good. Ona nejsou krátká. There is Levi. Hello, Levi. It's just mentioning here. Ona nejsou krátká. They are not short. Ona jsou dlouhá. Ona jsou dlouhá. Are they long? To jsou dobrá slova. To jsou dobrá slova. To jsou dobrá slova. Here we, see, we hear the je. Uh, to jsou. How are you doing this evening? They are dobrá slova. Hindi for hello. Yeah, it does look like it, doesn't it? The na we couldn't find just now. Royal we. The miesto is the word for a city. Dobra slova. They are good words. Ona jsou vysoká děvčata. Vysoká děvčata. Vysoká was tall, I believe. They are tall girls. Jsou to velká zvířata. Zvířata. They are velká. Big animals. Those are big animals. Yeah, whatever. Just wanted to do a bit of Irish, so I'm glad you're back. Did already do a bit. Just looking specifically for everyday phrases and such. But, good. It seems to be quite a lag today. A minute or so. So, if you're answering a question, <laughs> I might very likely will have forgotten what the question was. If it takes 30 to 60 seconds for the answer to get here. That's life. Okay, places. Let us continue. Kahar. This is a city, right? Kishjin Airfort. Kawil and Tarfort. Oh, look at that. We have a mismatch in this compound. Slender before the R. Broad after the F. Ha ha. And the T is not really prefixed. It looks like it's added, but it's really part of this article, historically. Nakaraha. Bala aklia agus karki. Karka, right? Karka. The cities. Dublin. And Cork. Corkle. Nusrodina. Srodina. A nice cluster there. Streets. How cool. Dropped the T. I think this is going to be a loan word from Latin. How does it lose its T? Does Celtic, does, does Irish just not have stra clusters? Tashid Ernest Rodney. Tashiv, you are, you plural. Er nasra tashit. Tashid Ernest Rodney. Srajani. Look at that, we hear an E at the end. Srajana. Er nasrajani. I bring she son Olwarga Marta Argidwaha. She works in the supermarket, but Money is away from her. Oh, Mar is because, not but. Because she needs money. I bring she son Olwarga, Marta Argidwaha. Marta Argidwaha. Todd Dantin in the Coney and Mashroid. Tadantin in a Kony Ermahraj on my street 
thy your auntie is living is in her dwelling on my street lives on my street Ich bin Brickfest, I can air for it. I eat. Oh, and we don't get the T showing up. How cool. Because it's in the dative case, I presume. Different case. I eat breakfast at the airport. Mohahir. Mohahir, my city. Kahahir. Always your cork with e, yeah, especially northern dialect. Kahir. Mohahir. Mohahir. My city, right? Singular? The Kahir. The Kahir. Your city. On will to Egan Air Fort? An air Fort? On will to Egan Air Fort? Are you? At the, this is going to be hard to remember that you don't have a T showing up in the dative at the airport. Tommy Mahoney, Sahahir. Tommy Mahoney, Sahahir. I am in my dwelling in the city. Shulim on airport. Shulim on to the from. What? From the air. I wonder if you own tear for it. Deal and share Tori, Agus Glossaries, and Olwarga. They sell fruits and vegetables in the supermarket. Tien Shiv Hogan Airfort. Tien Shiv Hogan Airfort. You go to toward the airport. Again, not the nominative, so no T here. Airport. It's Malam on Talwaragusha. Okay, here it's a nominative, the subject. Is good with me, that supermarket. I like that supermarket. This. What would it be? Shin? Antol warg shin? Warg. Antol warg sha. Is this one? Is malam antol warg sha. Too hard? Super By the way, have you recommended Duolingo to your dad? Practicing those kana? And anything you'd like to do today? Don't want to go too much longer, maybe another 20 or so. Got a morning class. Let's do a bit of Chinese next. Snopping. B. B compared to. Shan. Shan for a shirt, garment. Same sound as the mountain. B. B. Ooh, this one I don't know. Tiao. Tiao. Shan. Shan. Chen. Chen. Can't even hear what that is. Bi. Chen. Chen. Okay. Shin that shall this. Thank you. How can we remember? Shin distal show. The more consonants, namely two, the further away. Let's find out about this chen. I have a feeling this is a simplified form. For the clothing radical, it's going to be an L, D, I. And this doesn't have it. Okay, good. After. Irish breakfast. <laughs> Let us look this one up. The hand input, since that's not recovering it. E R I don't need the ten. A 
of my egg. Yeah, okay. Uh-huh. Quite a good simplification. Inner garments or match. The phonetic is chin. We say quite a few strokes that way. Inner garments. Chen. Your something, your shirt is very beautiful. Shan. Shan. I feel your shirt is too small. Need okay, we see the knife nice the knife the nice use of B topic is need your skirt B water compared to mine Pyaoyang is beautiful skirt or dress prettier than mine so got our topic ending with chinzi and then the comment is that it's prettier, and we mentioned the standard of comparison at the beginning of the topic part. Compare to mine. It's a verb phrase. Really. Why does it use the inch? Doesn't look like that was like that was in the traditional form. It was not. It uses it in order to simplify. Three strokes instead of L Y D U. Chen. Okay, having computer issues too. Computer or internet issues. I hope it's not catastrophic. Chen,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,衬,
Okay. I guess let's do a bit more Norwegian. I might call it a day after that. I don't know how this connection is going. Beste far. En beste far. En lillebror. Oh, nice. A compound. En lillebror. Morfar vil ha tomatsuppe. Morfar vil ha tomatsuppe. Grandmother wants tomato soup. Oh. <laughs> Not grandmother. Mother's father is the meaning. Søsken barn. Søsken barn. Søsken barn. Is that sibling child? Okay, it's the order noun, number, measure word. Yes. In Japanese, the particle will come right after the noun in contrast. And not at the very end of the phrase, like it does in Korean. Mormor er gammel. Potatoes, four pounds. Yeah, I suppose so. Mormor, mother's mother. What kind of compound is this? Ergammel. This gammel comes into English as a name, Gamble, which is the birth name of my murmur. My murmur is Gamble, but it means old. It's a nickname, the old one. Grandma is old. German has this nice, no. That would, ah, there is a compound type, of course, that would be if it was two people, mother and mother. So it's not that. Bittersweet, eh, I don't know about that. English doesn't really have dwindles. It'd be like if we said dad, mom, or parents. Hi, morfar. With this gammel, meaning old, German has fagammel. Standard German means to get old and rot, decay. Hi, Murfar. Hello, mother. Hello, Grandpa. Hi, Murfar. Sösken barna mina läser böcker. The my cousins read books. I think. Svogern min elske mat. Svogern, this is an old Indo-European word. Uh, German has Schwager, brother-in-law. And Sanskrit has Schwager. Schwager, I think, would be the close parallel. My brother-in-law, elsker mat. Loves food. Elsker. Yeah. Morfar spiser ikke lunch. Lunch. Grandpa doesn't eat lunch. Morfar spiser ikke lunch. Han er i slekt med tanten min. Han er i slekt. He is in... Slekt. In slekt. In the kinship. Bahurihi, dat brusha. Perhaps one of those. Yes, it is a TP. It means mother's mother. So it is a kind of mother, I suppose. Right? The first component tells you the possessor. The second component is a head noun. The 
subcompound is a good English approximate for Tatapurusha, a subtype of mother, namely the mother's one, the first component or delimits. Go to delimits. So he is in Schlecht. relatedness. He is related with my aunt. Related to. Lillebroren min liker ikke den boken. Lillebroren min liker ikke den boken. My little brother likes not that book. Er dere i slekt? Er det i slekt? Dere. Are you? Er dere? Mormor spiser suppe til middag. I don't think it means to noon, until noon, but at noon. Grandmother eats soup at noon. For dinner. Look at that. Okay. These gosh darn Norse mealtime words are hard to keep straight. Etymologically, it's of course midday, so it would have referred to lunch at one point, but it now means dinner. Eating soup for dinner. Jeg tror de er i slekt. I think they are related. Jeg tror de er i slekt. Jeg tror de er i slekt. Sounds like a shit palatalizing. Alle er i slekt med alle. Everyone is related to everyone, yes. Mormoren din har en bror. Your grandmother has a brother. Mormoren din har en bror. Lillebroren min lytter ved døren. Lytter ved døren. Looks like luchar. Lytter. Listening. Ved døren. With the door. Through the door. Lillebroren min lytter ved døren. Døren ved. Listening by the door. With the door. Hvor kommer svågeren din fra? Where does your brother-in-law come from? Hvor kommer svågeren din fra? Hvor kommer svågeren din fra? Ok, have an issues. Hvor kommer svågeren din fra? Morfar vil ha tomatsuppe. Mother's father. Grandpa wants tomato soup. Er dere i slekt? Are you related? Er dere i slekt? Mormor spiser suppe til middag. For dinner. Grandma eats soup for dinner. Not till, not at, but for. I mean. Okay, well, because of the glitchiness today, let's go ahead and call it a night. Thanks for joining. Let's do it again soon. Annyeonghigeseyo.